All right, so I'm here trying to catch some spotted bay bass, some halibut maybe. The water is a bit murky just because we had some recent rainstorm, some rainwater. So the water is going to be a little bit murky. So it's going to actually persuade what kind of lure I'm going to use to catch these spotties or any kind of species that's going to hit my lure. Um, I can go with the traditional swim bait, sardine color, or a spinner bait. But just because the water is murky, I'm gonna actually try a reaction bait, like a crankbait. So with that being said, I'm gonna try my luck using my homemade bottle cap lure from a ballast point bottle cap. <laughs> this uh, bottle cap I made at home acts like a crankbait. All I did was bent the bottle cap in half, put two holes on its end, one swivel and then one treble hook and then of course some beads and that's going to actually entice the bass or any halibut or any species to get this kind of crankbait just because it's a reaction type of bite i'm assuming so let's go ahead and uh, rig this guy up gear for today is going to be a lexa 300 on a shimano claris rod so that's my real rod combo today and I'm gonna be using a eight pound test Iser line so wish me luck I'm trying to get any species of fish on the reaction bait so I'm gonna go ahead and cast this guy as far as I can let it sink down the beads and the the metal of the bottle cap actually allows that crankbait that lure to sink down as soon as I feel bottom and do a little twitches just like that so see if uh, any biters getting any reaction oh yes got it on the crankbait oh it's a halibut oh <laughs> look at that ballast point bottle cap <laughs> holy moly nice little halley <laughs> Let's take this out. There you go. Thanks for letting me catch you, buddy. Woohoo! Alright. And I actually like this color bottle cap because it is pretty bright underwater. So if you see it, it jerks like that. So, and actually, here, you can hear it too. So when I jerk it, you can hear the crank, the, the rattling, just like a crack, crankbait. Oh yeah, nice. Oh, on the crankbait again. It was a nice body on that bottle cap. Look at that. On that bottle cap again. Look at that. Crankbait. Homemade. Ballast point. <laughs> awesome. Nice. Spotted bay bass. Look at that. Probably good 12, 13 inches. Maybe short of illegal. But, oh man. The murky waters really, really entice these uh, spotted bay bass. Even the halibut was caught today. Oh man, I need my pliers. He just... He really got this one. Oh man, this guy wanted it. There you go. So that nice little bottle cap acting like a crankbait. And this murky water is actually perfect for crankbait because the fish can't tell what it is, but it's getting them to bite this lure just because of the reaction of the sound of the rattle, just like a crankbait. So, all right, buddy. Oh man, this guy is nice too, because look at the belly. <laughs> All right, thanks for letting me catch you, buddy. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh, oh, mother effer. Caught something. Some seaweed. <laughs> thanks, thanks for letting me catch you, buddy.